Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. Uh, I'll, first off, I want to thank you guys for all the support on the last two videos. Uh, just reading those comments, like, you know, really kind of distracts me from what's really going on in life. Um, so thank you for those. That's very awesome, very kind of you, all the comments. A lot of you guys said that I should make a GoFundMe for, for things, and we're going to talk about that right now. Um, so I just got the phone with my brother, I just got a shower. Um, I wanted to make this video as soon as possible. So I, my brother said that the insurance company is fighting the claim for my mom's to pay out for the, the, for the funeral. And that is because the claim is so new. So I don't know, like, obviously I don't live with my parents. I don't know when they got their insurance claim, but, uh, p relatively new, I suppose. I, I mean, within two months, uh, that new, like, so the company is just like, uh, this is like, seems fake, you know? Um, so right as of right now, we have no money for my mom's funeral, which is like a huge deal. Um, uh, and it just motivates me and it makes me want to work even harder to just throw everything at it that I have. You know what I'm saying? Um, so apparently what's going on, like I said, is they're fighting the claim, the claim, uh, the pending claim can take up to 30 days. And the problem with it taking up to 30 days is the fact that, um, is that like when you when you have to have a funeral, it needs to be within like two weeks, I think. Otherwise, the uh, the person will be kicked out of the funeral home. Yeah, they're they're pretty serious about it. So uh, not only that, or we're like we're on a really really short timeline. Um, like my dad has, my dad is having a really really hard time with this, and the fact that like me and my brother have pretty much been doing a lot of the work, and he's just been like sitting on the couch drinking. Uh, so it's, it's really been tough on everybody because like we are trying to get things done, but he's like the primary person that needs to be doing it and he's not doing it. Um, so what that leaves is like me and my brother, you know, splitting the costs half and half. And that's if the funeral costs, you know, if it doesn't get approved. So, cause yesterday we thought everything was fine and like, like we were literally waiting on one fax to go through and everything would have been set in motion, but I guess the facts never went through or I don't know. I'm going to learn more very, very soon. Um, but, uh, the only thing I can do is make a GoFundMe account. Um, and I'm like, here's how I'm going to handle this. The, all the money that goes to the GoFundMe is going directly to my mom's funeral, nothing towards me or anybody else. Um, once the funeral was paid for, uh, then I'll worry about memorial things like I wanted to get like a plaque or something. That's that's not as important right now. I can always get that later on. Uh, every dollar will be accounted for. Uh, for those people who do pledge, I will make sure that you get a personal email from me myself letting you know where every dollar has went um, if you pledge, obviously. Um, and that's really the only thing I can do is ask you guys for help because I mean, this is like, I, I can't really get a loan because since I just got a divorce, um, my credit's been pretty sh like, let's be honest, pretty shit. Like, so trying to get a loan really wouldn't work. So I need to come up with like half the money. Uh, and funerals typically cost about $5,000. So my half would be around 2,500 to 3,000. Now I've said to go fund me for 5,000 just to cover everything just in case, uh, that's how obviously I might not need that much. I real like, honestly, I really don't know. I'm going to keep updating you guys as I learn what's going on. Um, I'm just, I'm stressed. I want to help my mom out as much as possible, like any way possible. So I'm going to ask for help is the only thing I know how to do. So, um, I hope you guys understand what's going on. Always make sure that you have insurance for at least six months because otherwise they're going to, yeah. So I'm, um, as I said, I will let you guys know in update videos or tweets or something, uh, mainly on the GoFundMe page, what's going on with this update. So if you can help out any, any, um, amount really helps guys. Um, so I will link you down below in the description to the GoFundMe. Uh, thank you all for watching. And regardless if you can pledge or not, thank you for your support. Have a great day, guys.